All right, before we begin the uh, next part of the second episode, uh, Bryce Cage on YouTube had commented that uh, they felt like I had uh, skipped over um, the captain information. So uh, this, I believe, is the uh, template that we're using for our current bounty hunter. This is the Boba Fett uh, V69, the valid template here. So we have E for the experience, Alpha priority for attributes, Bravo priority for skills, Charlie priority for ship, and Delta priority for contacts. I will um, pin this template um, or put a, put a link inside of the description for this template should anybody want to have it in the future. Welcome back to Sin's Arcade. This is episode two from season four of Star Traders Frontiers, where we're playing as a bounty hunter with Captain Fucht. Let's go ahead and get back into it. Hope you guys are having a great day out there. Where we left off on Thog's Loop, um, we are currently don't have any missions set up in, a, in, a, in advance, uh, and we were gonna be working our way to try to um, build up more rep, rep with everybody else. So when we left off, I think we were doing missions for the uh, for Bel Belkrin Vincetti. I remember that, <clears throat> and we just met Caligan Fane after we dropped off Estelle Broxstrom. So we're going to continue to try to build up represent a rep with everybody else. And I said I would do the storyline on this. That's right, I did. Urgh. Okay, so uh, we don't have very many credits, so let's go ahead and meet up with Fane and do that. See what Fane has to say. I'm going to skip this. If you guys really want to read this, we can um, go back through. So now we have a mission that's ordered for us. We still have our proving our charter missions. So we're going to leave this Arbiter Neutrality temporarily for just a little bit longer. And see if we can build both of those up. And I don't think we could. Oh, I guess we, guess we can choose all three. Aha. Let's grab those as well. Is this glitched? I don't know. I don't know if it is. All right, come back out. We're gonna check our missions. We have Artful Jumper, which we don't need just yet. We have Arbiter Neutrality. This has a two year expiration or deadline, two years, 11 weeks, and five days over here, and then a polarizing delivery. So we're gonna go ahead and follow with the polarizing delivery. This is we're picking up a transport case for Clan Zenrin uh, to deliver to Ry uh, Syndicate Reichert. So we're gonna go ahead and begin that there and head off wait where is this going the dixie maelstrom and this is sign memorial sin memorial pass or sign memorial pass okay so we're gonna have to come back and do that one later so let's go ahead and take off with this one first i apologize for the royalty free music that i used last episode i'll have to be a little bit more considerate about it in the future Hopefully you guys can hear my audio or my mic audio better this time. All right, so now we're here at Hunter's Hive. We have 31 with Zenrin. We're gonna go ahead and pick up the delivery. We're gonna do this all over the spice plate. Already maximum morale. I'm not too worried about the reputation at this point, so we're good. Let's go ahead and waypoint back. Uh, this is F, so we're not refueling here, but we might need to soon. Let's come back out, and since we're doing that one now, can we go from here? That's two jumps away. Let's go over and check this place out. Farming, oh, that's not gonna be good. But still, Bravo is better than nothing. We don't have any money for that, do we? Come on, all. Oh. There we go, everybody's paid. 58.43 to go. A bounty hunter from Steel Song. We're going to submit to inspection. We gained 30 experience and lost 25 morale. We have two people who need to be updated, so we're going to do that by going to the ship and then over to crew. We're just going to go ahead and continue with Doctor for her. And uh, let's see here. Pick field surgery. Uh, 
Uh, Dan Rolkins is an uh, Dan Rolkins is an engineer. We're gonna double down on engineer and pick up another engineering trade as well. We're gonna grab. Actually, I don't think we have any. That we, yeah, let's go ahead and grab that exact one there and come back out. We're good and jump. Thankfully, this hyper warp gate is not too far away. Jump here and head out. What do you mean we lack the passenger cabins? I thought we already got... Who do we have? <gasps> Wait, how did we not drop her off? That doesn't make any sense. Oh no, I may have failed this really badly. <laughs> Okay, um, well, let's go ahead and head over here and get that 10 grand there. That doesn't make any sense. Oh. Unavoidable fatality. Should I try it? Should I try it? Oh, why not? I've got to. Yeah! Relic armor. Level 8 protective armor, the frostburn mesh. We got lucky on that. I'm not pushing my put, pushing the trigger on that, or uh, pushing my luck. Thanks for bringing me this far. Brought you to Calican Fane, which we were already talking to Calican Fane. Oh, that's right. This is the mission itself. All right. So we don't have any negotiate skill, but we have a 20 charisma and we have a 26 wisdom. Since we have 26 wisdom, that's the one I'm going to choose. Days have passed. We passed the command and wisdom test, which on a hard difficulty, that's actually saying something that's kind of crazy. All right, so a little bit of money there. Go back over to the missions. Now can we go back to Artful Dodger? Oh, it's Steel Song Pirate. We don't have any loot or cargo, so they're gonna hold, they're gonna beat us up a little bit because we don't have anything. We lost 50 morale and gained 25 experience. I continue on. Artifact find. And land. Grab this. What do you mean? We don't lack the passenger cabin. Oh, because we're still carrying her around. That's why. I should have thought about that. All right. Well, let's go ahead and drop this off. I'm all over the map today. Literally and figuratively. Navigator's careful now. Arbiter neutrality. That did not, we got ship danger. Nope. Ship encounter. Retreat. Wait, let's deliver this first. We need the money. Oh, that's why. Um, does not look like we were gonna help. Above and board. We passed the negotiating charisma test, though. At least we got something out of that. Polarizing delivery. Oh, no. The thugs in the street outside the arranged me we meeting waste no time on pleasantries. Drawing illegal weapons and attacking immediately. If we can cut down the resistance, we can still achieve our mission. We did lose three rep with Syndicate Reichert, and our mission has taken four days. So now we're in, cro in combat. We're going to filter out by fighters only. Why didn't that filter go through? Oh, it is all the... Okay. Whatever. All right. So let's go ahead and... Choose Soldier. Slayer. And Medic. Yeah, that'll work. Look at how teeny tiny they look in this hallway. Don't take her out. What are you doing? Please be nice to me. Heal her. Come on. I should have probably given her that level 8 armor. I didn't even think about that till just now. Oh, come on. Leave her alone. Two people bleeding. Don't kill her. 
Come on, man. That's not even fun. Big bullies. And they're all early level, so they don't have really anything to work with. at all time. That's all that she can do at this point. Man, they are seriously picking on her. Come on, take him out. Alright, you have officers down. That's two down. Morale break, of course. Why am I not surprised? Kind of had a feeling that was going to happen. And there you go. Back. You... There. No, we need you to be bleeding as well. Oh, really? You're going to dodge that? Okay. The captain was not amused. Come on. Stop shooting at my friend. That's right. Oh. Finish her off, please finish her off. Yes! Woo! Can't lie, that was kind of hairy there for a second. Alright, combat log, we can look through. Crew report, everybody survived, so uh, Sergio Vigilatibus uh, has now advanced to level 5. And Yuri Locke, who thankfully survived, our doctor, the only officer who went into this combat, will actually upgrade to level 4, thankfully. I'm so glad she didn't perish. We've been victorious in risky combat, and we transported the case, gaining 44,000.4 for our part. Woo, that was that was hairy. I'm not going to lie. It was very, very hairy. All right. No more medical spice, because we don't have our negative 23 automatically with rye shirt, which, eh, I can get over that. That's not a big deal to me. All right. Arbiter neutrality. Let's go ahead and head back over there. <clears throat> and we're going to jump. And of course, a pirate for Zenrin. Oh, come on, man. Should you leave me alone? Can't you see we're friends? All right. We're going to... Troubling return. Many is, uh, return welcomes Estelle. What will you do next? Uh, recurse myself from proceedings. Is the case lost? Bitter tooth. You're a cold-hearted creature, but I love you. Or at least somebody does. We returned Arbiter and we got 12,000 for our part. We're going to heal back up. We're going to quickly upgrade everybody. Let's go there. Oh, come back over to Talents. We're not level 5 just yet, so we need. Steadfast Aim, Lethal Trap, Blood Game. Dun, 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 dun. That works, yeah, because I'm not... There you go. That'll work. There's that. Come back out. And next. Train jobs. Doctor goes to four. Engineer goes to four. Quartermaster goes to three. And gains. What? Nope, we got that. What about this one? Notice I'm leaning on skill saves first, because I'm playing on hard difficulty. I want skill saves above and beyond any of the other stuff, at least in the early game, until I have more people who might be able to help out with that. So, it looks like I only have one talent of this type amongst the crew, so we're going to go in for this Intimidate test and grab that. And I think that's everybody, right? Is there anybody else? Nope, nobody else. Alright, so, I don't want to talk to Fane. We want to go ahead and go back and try to complete this last mission. Which will get us a little bit more money. Now we're up to 60,000. A Reichardt Explorer. We can retreat from. This is an Explorer. Failed ship ops test. Can land. Grab the Artful Dodger. Um, we will Daring Disguise. Ooh, we passed the Stealth and Quickness. Didn't think we were going to. I wasn't entirely sure we were going to. All right, go ahead and grab all out. 
So he needs to upgrade or level up. All right, the captain again. Nice. Back out. And over. If I'm going too fast, please let me know by all means, guys. I'm just so familiar with the game, I'm trying to speed things up. Make it entertaining, or at least trying to. If you've liked anything you've seen thus far, please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. It really does help out a small channel like myself. Trying to grow. It helps the algorithm see me. Helps new people see me. Artful Dodger. Parting over Spice Beer. Alright, and that leaves us right here next to uh, Belkrin Vincetti. We may grab another mission from him on the next episode. Um, and... We have two more that need to upgrade. So the doctor, she goes to level five. And now once I've picked her, here's the thing that I'm gonna do before we go any further. So now she's finally level five on doctor. Meaning that at this point, I like to wait until they get their primary job up to level five before I start looking at what the next thing was gonna be. So in this case, she has evasion. As a doctor, um, in this case, she gets doctor, command, and tactics. Right, so every round, every every rank that she gets in that job is going to give her this. However, if you look at over here in her skills, she has a uh, uh, she has a secondary evasion skill, which means that she might be beneficial to make her a pistolier, or it might be beneficial to make her something that's going to lean on evasion. So, for example, if you look at the different jobs here, assassin has evasion as one of its as one of its bits. So, I'm going to be looking for something like that, like bodyguard or rifle hunter. You know what I mean? So I'm going to pick something like that to, to kind of uh, exoscout. Something along that has evasion in it to kind of lean into the skills that she already has. Because everything else will fall into place after that. And we'll, we'll build that up as we continue to go on. That's usually the kind of the way that I build it up. And it's, it's usually worked pretty well thus far. At least for me in the multiple years that I've been playing this game. Same thing now with this pilot. This pilot is just junior crew. But she has rifles and, ex uh, and explore. Wow. This is a good candidate right here for a, an officer in the future. If she survives long enough. Alright, and she needs... Three members know this one, but... Mm, talents. Yeah. Rated fire, sharp steering. We don't have sharp steering at all. Actually, she's level 5, so we can choose level 5s first. Twitch Surge. I think Sharp Steering is still the better option. So we're going to choose that. And I'm going to call it it, uh, call it for this one, guys. Don't forget um, that I'm trying to keep to my schedule. Um, so if nothing else, every Tuesday going forward will be uh, Star Traders Tuesday. I'm not sure I can get the Thursdays up and running. Um, it just depends on how things go. Thank you for your patience. And I hope to see you in the next one. Have a great one. Fly safe.